Hey, what's up YouTube? Scott, Scotty Tradition, coming back at you with a, another video. Um, got a couple of interesting pickups this week I'm going to show you. Um, it is not card related, but it is memorabilia related. Um, so I grabbed a couple pieces as you can see here. Um, first we'll go with the first piece I grabbed. Um, picked this up from a, fa uh, fr a fellow Packer collector in a different Facebook group um, of Packer collectors and um, met him on... I think it was Wednesday and picked this up. So just a beautiful looking, uh, this is a Bart Star advertisement. It's called the Bart Star lineup. It's from the uh, Lacrosse Rubber Mills Shoe Company. And um, you can see their logo right there and all these different kinds of shoes. Got the Cruiser, the Tourney, the Athletic, the Jog Shoe, the Graphite. And um, he did sign his name um, with a couple inscriptions there. So pretty neat. Apparently the shoe actually went through here as part of the display. Uh, so the shoe actually went right through this part here and um, there's lots of different shoes. These shoes actually do come up on eBay every now and again. Um, I'd love to actually get one to go with with this and I'm not sure how I display it but um, so pretty neat. Um, there is the back. Um, got a full letter from uh, JSA. Although you can I could tell even without that that it is an authentic Bart Star signature. So, really a pretty cool piece. Um, so I picked this up on Wednesday, and then on Thursday there's another piece here um, that I grabbed off eBay on that 15% off deal. I think it was Wednesday or Thursday, I forget. But it already came in, and uh, really fast shipping. And this is like a full-size poster, I guess. You can see the size difference between the two and just another advertising piece for these shoes um, and what makes this cool is this is actually I actually went to college at the University of Wisconsin La Crosse um, so that makes this piece kinda more special to me pretty cool so I got the auto piece there and this piece here I guess there are some other display pieces that that are kinda similar just a little bit of variance in them that were that came out these are uh, display pieces that came out in the late 60s and early 70s. So pretty neat pieces. Um, you don't you don't see these very much at all, but and you certainly don't see them signed very much. So I was excited to grab these. So now the goal is to try to find one of these pairs of shoes to actually maybe go with the set. Um, I guess it's hard to find them in like normal sizes though, from what I hear. A lot of the sizes you find are like size five, six, that kind of stuff. Um, but if I could find one in my size, like a ten and a half or eleven, I would be tempted to wear them actually, because they're pretty sweet looking, vintage early '70s, late '60s shoes. So pretty neat. Well, that's all I got for you guys on this video. Um, thanks for watching, and hope you enjoyed a little something different with these two pieces here that I picked up. All right, you guys have a great day. Thanks.